Cool schools time. Cool schools Wednesday. Really, it's just like a boot. Possibly. It's like a boot print. 32 inches, though, long. Well, maybe they have big feet. All right, WBIR 10 News reporter Rebecca Sweet live at Ball Camp Elementary School this morning. Hey there. Um, you know, just writing a detention slip for William. Here you go, William. We'll see you after school. Wait, wait, okay. Wait, oh, wait. What are you doing? That's my I job mean, and my <laughs> desk. Principal Bringle, I mean, I just haven't had a chance to ever really do this out of all the cool schools I've been to, and I just wanted to take this opportunity. But you know what? I, I agree, since it is, you know, Principal's Day and all, I agree that this is your position. So we do have Principal Bringle here. I was trying to take over her job, but no one can do your job. <laughs> tell me, you got to tell me, Ball Camp Elementary School is so awesome. You have so many students yes. that go here. What do you think makes this school so cool? I, we have the best school and the best kiddos and the staff in all of the county. Um, um, we have lots of different interests and lots of kids that excel in different areas and lots of teachers and staff members that put in 100% extra effort all the time for a great day. It is so cool and it's over 500 students. Mm -hmm. What would you say is your thought when you come into school every single day and you see these students? That I'm just ready for a great day of learning and what fun is going to happen every day. And you're lucky enough that you have both your kiddos that go to this school as well. Um, you know, what's it like when you see them coming home and just exceeding in a school that you can really have a lot of pride in? Um, it's it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun to get to be on the parent side and the administrator side. So I get to have wear both hats every day. Okay, well, we're excited to be here. Principal Bringle has been so fun already this morning. But unfortunately, I mean, William, he's still... Uh, yes, William, we'll be seeing you after school. You still have detention. Sorry, William. Hey, we're going to send things now over to Mike. We are live at Ball Camp Elementary School. And we are Cool School. It is Cool Schools Wednesday. Yes, it is. And WBIR 10 News reporter Rebecca Sweet live at Ball Camp <laughs> Elementary School this morning. Hey there. Good morning, Abby and Russell. I got to tell you, this school is so cool, but I can't tell you why. I mean, the students are going to give you a best explanation why. So we have four awesome kids here. You guys tell me your name, your grade, and what makes the school so cool. My name's Cole, and I'm in fifth grade, and I like our school because we got a new playground that has slides and a lot of monkey bars. Ooh. My name's Kate, and I'm in fourth grade, and I like our school because we get to do fun field trips. Fun field trips. That's awesome. My name's Santana and I'm in third grade. And the reason why I like our school is because we have so many great books here that everybody can read and I love reading. So um, it's very fun for me to read all these books. Oh, that's awesome, Santana. And we're in the library. What about you, Emery? Hi, I'm Emery Cade and I'm in second grade. And I think our school is great because we have fun science experiments. Oh, and guess what? We're going to be seeing one of those science experiments later on in the show. And guess what else? You want to know why this school is so cool? This is home to Miss Leslie Ackerson. Let's show you what she looked like in second grade. Can you get right there? Oh, little Leslie. Again, we're having a lot of fun this morning out at Ball Camp Elementary School. Do you guys want to toss it back to the station with me? Ready? Let's say on the count of three, we'll say back to you. Ready? One, two, three. Back to you. <laughs> okay. Like, you want to say thank you? That, thank thank you. you. Wednesday here on Channel 10. Yes, and this is always fun. Rebecca Sweet is live at Ball Camp Elementary this morning. Hey, lady. Morning, Abby and Rosa. Well, we've been talking to some students earlier. Now we're going to be talking to some students where their passion really lies in art. And they have got some cool projects that we're going to show off. So first off, tell me your name. Which project do you have over there, and what's your favorite part about it? I'm Elias, but I go by Eli. My project is um, the big dragon that took me a while to build. It took for off. It took me two classes, but there was f four or five. Oh wow! And um, and it, it looks took forever to bend to figure out the way to bend the tail and how to get everything built on. Oh cool! And it's awesome. What about you? Hi, my name is Veda, and mine is the person and the dog. Oh, yeah. They're both wearing glasses, and it took me um, about the full four days to make the both of them. Oh, sweet. What about you? 
My name's Lily, and I made the dog with the doghouse, and it took me um, more than the four art classes could go. And this is the awesome art teacher who's in charge of all these wonderful students. What about you, bud? Um, my name's Easton, and I, I built a rocket ship, and it took me a while to build it because I, I messed up on the the slanting part, oh, yeah. and and then I fixed it, and then it was good. Awesome, good job. Um, my name is Logan, and I made the um, cat, and one of my favorite things about it is that it kind of looks like a fox and a cat, so it could be either. We call it fox cat. I thought it was a fox as well. Um, my name is Rhett, and I made the knight. The night, and you did along with your brother who made the dragon. It looks really cool. And the one cool part about all of this is that it's made out of recycled items. And there's art all over this school, from the recycled items that they have to a really cool display downstairs as well. One of the many things that makes this school so cool. Are you guys excited us being here this morning? Yeah. 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 All right. Good job. You guys did great. We're going to send things now back to you in the studio. It is a Cool Schools Wednesday, and WBIR 10 News reporter Rebecca Sweet is live at Ball Camp Elementary. Good morning. <laughs> morning, Abby and Russell. We got a lot of stuff going on, so we're going to get right to it. First, I want to tell you what we think is so cool about the school. We have some students here. Tell me your name and what makes this school so cool. I'm Jasmine, and the staff are really nice, and they're, they make teaching really fun. Them. What do you think makes this school so cool? My name is Noah, and I like my I like my friends in recess. Awesome. And what about you? You gotta tell me a little bit more about this my, experiment. Um, it goes up. It will go up, and because hot air rises, because right? Because hot air rises, and it's dense less dense than the room temperature air. Awesome, and this is all part of STEM Scouts, so come on over here. This is the instructor of STEM, uh, STEM Scouts. First, tell me your name and how long you've been doing this. Uh, I'm Jim McElroy. Uh, this is my son, Ransom. I got involved three years ago. STEM Scouts is through the Boy Scouts of America. Uh, Knoxville was actually a pilot market for that program. It's, I believe, nationwide now. Anyway, we meet about once a week. We have 14 third, fourth, and fifth graders at Ball Camp Elementary. We perform different science experiments, try to get them some education and interest in the um, technology behind all these experiments. Today, we're working um, on a program with fluid dynamics. This particular experiment involves uh, heating air. We're experimenting with the dif uh, density of hot air versus cold air. And let's let it go. Okay, let's do. Go ahead. Ready? Woo! All right, y'all, we got one more job we got to do. Ready? One, two, three. And now to end the traffic. <laughs>